Hey guys, Coach Maggie here and Registered Dietitian with Physique Development. What I want to talk to you guys about today is how to choose generally healthy foods if you're a person who's trying to improve your health, maybe lose a few pounds, feel better, and you're not quite sure how or which foods are considered healthy over others and why. So getting started, the first thing I want to go over is breakfast, okay? So I've worked in a lot of different settings with a lot of different types of patients. And one of the funniest things I've learned or I've heard is patients telling me they're having oatmeal cream pies or something similar to this for breakfast and they think they're having something healthy because oatmeal is in the name okay so tip number one would be to read your food labels and get comfortable with what's in your food and how much sugar or added sugar is in that food so oatmeal cream pies and things similar of this nature are gonna be really high in sugar and pretty low in overall nutrition Okay, so another one that's not so great is gonna be, you know, kids cereals, or cereals I should say marketed to kids. Something like a cinnamon toast crunch over here, filled with sugar, definitely void of most nutrients that keep us full and satisfied and energized throughout the day. So a better option would be good old oatmeal. This Quaker brand is a very, very popular, common brand I see among many people. Um, this is what one I would say would be just good, not great, simply because of the added sugar content in this type of product, but still better because it's not as much sugar as an oatmeal cream pie or anything of that nature. It's still oatmeal, so it's gonna have that soluble fiber that's gonna be good for your heart, helps to keep that that cholesterol at bay um, but it's definitely not a perfect food something that would be a little bit better would be maybe something like better oats or the RX brand both have little to no added sugar RX is fantastic because they actually list on the front of the label here exactly what's in their food how it's sweetened this is sweetened with dates which I think is wonderful because it's a natural form of sugar which basically means that sugar is going to come alongside of vitamins and minerals and fiber so much so that regular sugar wouldn't. And then the very best breakfast choice would be good old fashioned oatmeal. No additives, no flavorings, no sugar. You actually make this taste how you want it to taste and it's gonna have all of those health benefits, all of the soluble fiber, all of the things that are gonna help you to stay full and satisfied for a long period of time. So typically what I like to do when I have oatmeal, pair it with some fresh fruit, maybe some scrambled eggs, um, but how you prepare it is completely up to you. There's lots of different things you can do with breakfast. Thank you for watching. If you're wanting the best programming of your life for about a dollar a day, check out our app, Physique Development Training Club.